Hello and welcome to History of the Day series of Triumph IAS. First we will start from the important death anniversary of 16th February. Meghnad Saha Death Anniversary Meghnad Saha was a pioneer in astrophysics in India. He made a remarkable contribution to the field of astrophysics. His study of the thermal ionization of elements led him to formulate what is known as the Saha equation. This equation is one of the basic tools for the interpretation of the spectra of stars in astrophysics. By studying the spectra of various stars, one can find their temperature and from that, using Saha's equation, determine the ionization state of the various elements making up the star. He also invented an instrument to measure the weight and pressure of solar rays and contributed to the construction of several scientific institutions, including Allahabad University's Physics Department and the Institute of Nuclear Physics in Calcutta. He founded the journal Science and Culture and served as its editor until his death. He was the driving force behind the formation of several scientific societies, including the National Academy of Science, the Indian Physical Society, and the Indian Institute of Science. During 1953 to 1956, he was the director of the Indian Association for the Cultivation of Science. The Saha Institute of Nuclear Physics, founded in 1943 in Kolkata, is named after him. Saha was an active parliament member in education, refugee and rehabilitation, atomic energy, multipurpose river projects, and flood control, and long-term planning. He was India's chief architect of river planning, and he created the original Damodar Valley Project Plan. Moving on to the important events happened on 16th February. Number 1. First Rail Service Between India and Nepal In 1927 on this day, the rail link between Nepal and India is ready to resume on the neighbouring country's first-ever broad-gauge passenger service. The first stretch was a 34 kilometers line between Bihar's Jainagar and Nepal's Kurta. Number 2. Kyoto Protocol came into effect. In 2005 on this day, the Kyoto Protocol, an international treaty aimed at reducing the emission of gases that contribute to global warming, went into effect. 2005. The Kyoto Global Warming Pact went into effect in 140 nations. The Kyoto Protocol mandated that industrialized nations cut their greenhouse gas emissions at a time when the threat of global warming was growing rapidly. The protocol was linked to the United Nations Framework Convention on Climate Change. It was adopted in Kyoto, Japan on 11 December 1997 and became international law on 16 February 2005. Countries that ratified the Kyoto Protocol were assigned maximum carbon emission levels for specific periods and participated in carbon credit trading. If a country emitted more than its assigned limit, then it would be penalized by receiving a lower emissions limit in the following period. Number 3. King Tutankhamun Unsealed On 16 February 1923, the burial chamber of King Tutankhamun's recently unearthed tomb was unsealed in Egypt. King Tutankhamun's tomb is situated in the Valley of the Kings, east of the Nile River in Egypt. In 1907, the English archaeologist Edward Russell Ayrton uncovered a pit in the area containing pots, dishes and other objects belonging to Tutankhamun, then a relatively unknown 14th century B. C. F. R. O. Mr. Ayrton's sponsor, the American Theodore M. Davis, proclaimed that he had discovered Tutankhamun's tomb and donated some of the objects to New York's Metropolitan Museum of Art. After years of study, Herbert Winlock, a curator at the Met, determined that the objects were left over from the embalming process and funeral, and that the pit was not actually Tutankhamun's tomb. 